Hello and welcome back to another video. So Rogue Energy has finally released their own coffee flavor. It was announced around like a week ago, and since my last Rogue Shake review did so well in views, I went and picked up this flavor as soon as I could when it went on pre-sale. So I got the bad boy right here, so I guess let's just get straight into unboxing this. This new package design is actually kind of cool. They really changed up the design compared to the old design, which was just straight up like, you know, Rogue on like black and white text. But yeah, I'm really loving the new package design. But anyways, let's go ahead and get this open. Go ahead and slice there. Okay, first of all, let's see what these things to the side are. Okay, yeah, you got the stereotypical thank you for your order little graphic here. They have these in, like, every package you get from Rogue Energy. But yeah, that's that. Ooh, got a new Rogue Nation sticker. This one's actually pretty clean. What in the world is going on with my camera? Okay, got a little Rogue Shake graphic. Camera, can you please focus? This is pretty much just telling you how to make the drink. Okay, that's just padding. Don't need that. And here is the tub. Let's go ahead and open this up real quick. Oh my gosh. That is so clean. Yo, this actually looks sick. They even have the Rogue Energy logo on the lid here. So to kind of compare this new tub design to the old tub design, I'm just gonna hold them up side by side. There's actually a pretty big size difference here. Like, the lid is so tall on this one. Although I think the funniest part about this is that the smaller tub has 40 servings and the bigger one has 30 servings. <laughs> but yeah, when they changed the tub design, they didn't just change the design. They changed the entire tub. But yeah, this is the new Rogue Shake Caramel Vanilla Latte flavor. Anyways, let me go ahead and show you the full design of the tub real quick. Here are the ingredients. I'm not going to go through all of them, but if you want to pause the video and read through them, you can. But yeah, these are all the ingredients here. Here's what it says on the side. You can pause the video and read this as well if you want to. But uh, yeah, that's the full design of the tub. Honestly, this is a really nice tub design. Like, this is probably one of my favorite designs from Rogue Energy so far. Anyways, let's go ahead and get this tub open and see what the powder looks like. Oh, they have a new design for the whatever the crap this thing's called. Rogue Energy didn't just change their tub designs. They changed the design of like everything. Okay, let's go ahead and get this off real quick. Oh my gosh. That was the first time I was able to just like easily take this off. Normally I have to like take a knife and jam it in there a lot and like peel at this stuff for like a long time. But like this time it just straight up came right off. Oh, that is strongly coffee. Yeah, that smells strongly of coffee. So that is what the powder looks like. It pretty much just looks the same as the powder in the French vanilla iced coffee flavor from G Fuel. The powder pretty much looks the same as the powder in this tub right here. The only noticeable difference between the two powders is that Rogue Shakes flavor is slightly darker in powder, and then G Fuel's French vanilla iced coffee is a lighter powder. But then again, it might only look different because Rogue Shakes flavor is in like a darker like black tub, and then G Fuel's French vanilla iced coffee flavor is in like a white tub but yeah that's what the powder looks like now of course since this is in the rogue shake lineup and not the regular rogue energy lineup you're supposed to make it with milk so let's go ahead and get this poured real quick okay i got a nice 16 fluid ounces there so let's go ahead and add the powder get the filter in first oh gosh i hate digging for the scooper okay let's get a nice even scoop of this okay that's about a nice even scoop there so let's go ahead and add it to the milk now, one of the things that I love about the Rogue Shake flavors is that unlike some of G Fuel's flavors like cotton candy, strawberry shortcake, French vanilla iced coffee, this is actually made specifically for milk because those G Fuel flavors like, you know, French vanilla iced coffee and strawberry shortcake, they're still technically made for water, but the Rogue Shake flavor is actually made specifically to go in milk. So it mixes in the milk pretty well compared to some of these G Fuel flavors. But anyways, let's go ahead and get this shaken up. Okay, I think that's shaking up pretty well. Okay, let's see how much fizz there is. I am kind of worried to do this, because I'm not sure if it's going to straight up, like, overflow. Rogue Energy has a habit of their drinks just, like, overflowing with fizz. Oh, gosh. Yeah, there's a lot of fizz there. It's, like, all up inside the lid. Look at that. Okay, let's just get this lid back on before it starts, like, spilling. But anyways, I guess let's just go ahead and see what this smells like. The smell is very faint, but I mean, it, it's pretty much just coffee. I I mean, what else is there to say? It's, it's, it's literally just coffee. Kind of smells a little similar to G Fuel's French Vanilla Iced Coffee flavor. Okay, the caramel is coming through a little bit. It's like 60% coffee and then like 40% caramel. Like the smell of caramel is there, but it's like very faint. But yeah, I think that's the best I can kind of explain the smell. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and try this and I'll let you all know what I think of it. Dang, that is good. Like right off the bat, obviously... It tastes like coffee, like, no crap, duh. But that caramel's definitely coming through a lot. In a way, it is slightly similar to G Fuel's French Vanilla Iced Coffee flavor. Oh my gosh, I figured it out. Okay, okay, I know what this tastes like now. This is reminding me of, like, every once in a while, my parents used to get 
these like Starbucks like mochas or frappuccinos or whatever the crap they're called I'll show a picture of what I'm talking about like right there on the screen But it's reminding me of that. But yeah, this is a pretty decent flavor Like this is something I would have on my daily rotation But like if you're a fan of coffee, but you don't necessarily drink energy drinks all that often Then this is probably a good flavor to start off with for you It's got that nice coffee taste to it and it's not like artificial or anything like this doesn't really taste like fake coffee Obviously, it's not like legit legit coffee as in like, you know black coffee and then you put in some creamer and stuff But it does taste like something you would get from like Starbucks or something Obviously, you know if you've never drank coffee in your life then like don't don't get this flavor like what? What is wrong with you? Why would you do that? See, if I was to rate this, probably give it a solid 8.2 out of 10. Now, personally, I don't think this is their greatest flavor yet, but it's definitely not their worst. It's definitely up there. Like, I think I put this in the top three of all of Rogue Energy's flavors so far. But yeah, 8.2 out of 10, great flavor. Rogue Energy really outdid themselves with this flavor. Like, you can really tell they worked hard on this flavor, and it really paid off well. But anyways, if you want to pick up this product, you can use code Great for 10% off. That's just a way you can help support my channel while at the same time saving yourself some money. But anyways, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Make sure to smack the like button and to subscribe if you haven't already. Hasta la vista, scrubs. Yeah.